Hey everyone, Technomancer here with the video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to review iOS 18.4, the latest update on the iPhone 12 Pro. We're going to talk about the top features, performance, battery life, and if you should upgrade to this version or not. So let's get right into it. So iOS 18.4 is geared toward devices that are compatible with Apple intelligence. Unfortunately, the iPhone 12 Pro will not get Apple intelligence with this update either, but you are still gonna get some features. Some of the features that you're gonna see are like new set of emojis, like the ones shown here. You're also gonna see uh, for CarPlay, a third row of apps for some users as well, depending on the car model you have. Now, along with those updates, you're also gonna see updates around things like Apple Wallet, where you can now track your order and your subscription directly on the wallet itself. You're gonna see other things such as being ability, the ability to change the default translation app directly on your phone instead of using Apple's Translate app. Now along with that is if you use Apple Maps, you can now set a preferred language as well. There's also an update for the App Store as well where you're gonna be able to see reviews of apps before you download them. So if you go down here, there is a user review which is a summary which in the past you would have to read a review but they're gonna summarize it for you. And you can also pause download directly on the App Store as well if you're downloading something you don't wanna download. And then when it comes to a Control Center, there are gonna be new controls available for ambient music that you can add. As you see a new section here, where you can play ambient music by selecting just the control here that will launch Apple Music to play the type of music that you want to select to play. So those are gonna be some of the features that come with this update as well. Now there is also update around back tap. Whenever you tap it, a notification will pop up, which in the past you did not get that. Now, if you're also using the passwords app built into it, you're gonna be now able to see your timer for two-factor authentication code built into the app as well. So those are gonna be the top features of iOS 18.4 on the iPhone. 12 Pro. So other thing you're going to probably wonder is how the performance is. The performance has been stable. The 12 Pro, again, still a great device if you're still using it. Most of your apps will work without any issues. If not, all of them are going to work, again, without any issues on this version because it is fully supported from your entertainment app to your social media app to productivity tool. All of that and much more will be working again, flawlessly on this device that we have seen so far, haven't encountered any issues with it. And there doesn't seem to be any bug fixes we notice based on our experience. Of course, everyone experience is different. So if you have any experience, do share it in the comment section. Now, another aspect of this update is the battery. So the battery has been stable. We haven't noticed anything like the phone heating up or battery draining unexpectedly on this update because it is .8 four version which means it's a pretty stable version which leads us to the question is this upgrade worth it now if you're already on one of the 18 version definitely worth it to of course get those bug fixes and security enhancement but if you're already on 17 and you don't plan on upgrading to 18 you can still stick around for 17 sometime but sooner or later you're going to be forced to upgrade to 18. so again if i were to recommend i would recommend it but again each person as a different opinion. That's why I want to hear from you. What's your thought? If you upgraded any of your phone to 18.4, leave a comment in the comment section and what is your favorite feature on 18.4? Do share it in the comment section as well. And if you found this review helpful, please consider hitting a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.